getting tagged all weekend long. Do not buy your fake Coldplay tickets. Uh, people are being warned not to purchase Coldplay tickets online from scammers. Uh, first of all, who was up at 9 p.m.? Uh, on Saturday at your laptops trying to get Coldplay tickets? Not me. I thought my media pass would get me in. Oh, rookie. <laughs> Serious rookie. <laughs> you thought your media... Like, there's a lot of media. Do you think that, like, thousands of media are just going to get tickets? I Not really the case, thought... Simran. She actually came yeah. in this morning. She's like, why are you trying to get tickets? I was like, we don't get tickets. <laughs> what? There should be some perks, but okay. Well, there is. We get a media pass for the whole six months. Okay, yeah. Um, anyway, <laughs> Coldplay fans all over the UAE... and around the world to the tune of 500,000 people. That's right, half a million people were online on the Expo site trying to get those tickets uh, after it was announced that there would be free tickets along with your Coldplay Plus and it went live. People were waiting uh, in the queue for two hours. Uh, some were successfully able to score tickets and many were not, as you can imagine, um, with a venue this size. And like any other anticipated concert, what's happened, are, what's happened is the people who got tickets Some of these guys, you nasty people, uh, the resellers are going online, they're going to places like Dubai to resell their tickets. So now the free ticket has now gone up from eight, uh, 300 to 800. Oh my God. <laughs> free tickets. That is insane. 800 dirhams for something you would see for free? Mm-hmm. That's crazy. Um, Expo 2020 Dubai immediately sent out a cautionary announcement for fans to refrain from buying. They said, we are aware that some free tickets for Coldplay's concert on 15th of February are being resold for money online. We caution visitors against paying money to an untrusted source. The original purchaser may distribute more than one of the same ticket, mm. leading to fraudulent sales. Each ticket has a unique QR code which can be used only once. Anyone arriving with a QR code that has already been used will not gain entry to the concert venue. So imagine... You go, you pay 500 for a ticket. It's Coldplay. You pay 500, but they've already sent that same QR code ticket to many other people. Yeah. Don't buy them online. And I know it could be very tempting. Just don't do it. Honestly, don't. Just see it. Uh, It's going to be live streamed anyway on our platforms, from Expo's platforms, so you can catch it there. But I get, I really understand, like, wanting to see them live. That's, That's a whole different thing. But I mean, for 800 dirhams and then not even getting the entry, is it worth it? No. I got a ticket. Casey, of course. I got a ticket. Congratulations. I feel like um, With a lot Charlie of- and the Chocolate Factory, I got the golden ticket. So I, was, <laughs> I put up my stories like everyone else sitting at your laptop. The site crashes. So what happened, it was like five to nine. You go online, you log in, and, it's, and it gives you a little tip. It's like if you're registered before, it'll be quicker, smoother process. You register. And then it goes, it gives you a 30 second countdown. It says you're in the queue. It goes down and down. And it gets down to one and then it refreshes. And it says, do not refresh the page. And it continues to do this, but you're still like, I'm getting there. And then the site <laughs> crumbled. Oh no. Half a million people are on the site trying to get tickets. Yeah. It's like schedule maintenance. We're down, but we're trying to work it out for you and all this. And you, you believe it, you trust it. <laughs> um, but then it's happening to everyone else. And then, and then it gets, it's like 40 minutes later and you're like, there's no way I'm getting a ticket. I shared a story and I was like, the struggle is real. A lot mm. of people were having the same struggle. However, it worked for some people. Our intern, Mahika. Oh. She got a couple of tickets. Oh. oh She oh. messaged me. Oh. She said I could have two. Oh, you got from Mahika. Yeah. Nice, Casey. How that just worked out. You have to put it out into the universe. So, Mahika, I love you. You're amazing. I'll t- I give her those tickets. I said, are you sure you don't want to resell them? No. I said, are you sure you don't want to give them to someone else? And she was like, well, actually, she only needed two, but she put four down. Oh, nice. Um, and one other person who messaged me was really struggling for ages, and then their tickets came through. So it was just absolute luck of the draw. That's really <sighs> nice. I mean, you were on that website for a very long time. Everyone so. was. But like everyone was. And like half a million people, that means people clearly from outside of the country. Well, I mean, it could have been all the country. People from all over the world. Like a free Coldplay concert uh, by Expo. Just amazing. Like free apart from your ticket. Um, we'll never see the, like, uh, the, the likes of it again. And in Awasal, it's just going to be That's spectacular. That's what, exactly. Um, you can still go to Expo and watch it on big screens in Jubilee Park if you would like to. Um, you can also, as Simon said, watch it online. Uh, but it's going to be amazing. Oh, my goodness. Just the visuals. Like, we saw how Alicia Keys and for Black Eyed Peas, how the whole dome lights up. It's going to be so magical. That too, with their playlist and their vibe. It's just, oh, can't even. What time are you going to be there at Expo? Is my question. 
Um, you so have to be there early. It starts at nine. I'll probably just go straight from work, maybe try and mm. get some food, see what the lay of the land is. Because <laughs> like, I, if it starts at nine, but you have a ticket, so you think that you're kind of guaranteed a place. But yeah. I don't know. Like, The queues it, are going to be so long, Casey. You no, have no, to. because it's, it's, a, it's a... um Controlled amount of number. That's the thing. So it's more controlled than before. It is going to be busy. Um, so let's see on well, that People one. are still going to try their luck, no? They're going to go there and they're going to try. If they get in, they get in, you know? I think that, I think people will go to the main places to watch it because I was thinking, like, you'll be able to hear it live. Yeah. Um, but of course, Expo was very quick, by the way, with that statement, uh, alerting people there were apologies for the inconvenience and uh, just to not buy those fake tickets online because they could easily, easily be a scam. But before we move on, honestly, it's amazing. Casey, how it's come back in a full circle. You missed the New Year's concert for Coldplay two years ago? Three years ago. Three years years ago. And now you're finally getting to see them. I won't believe it until I'm there. Right. You know, right. I'm you one of those people. It. I'm like, I'm, yeah, I'm excited. But like, uh, until I'm there, I'm not yeah. going to like imagine it's happening because so many things can change. It's COVID. You just can't expect anything these days. You know? okay, let's not talk about it anymore. <laughs> 